Morning guys, uh, you know, forgive the mess. I'm, I'm like one of those organized chaos sort of people. Uh, comment down below like, are you one of those people that like everything appears junky from the outside but like you know exactly where everything is? Or like, are you one of those like less is more, I can only see exactly what I need and I have to have like broad sweeping clean surfaces? You know, hashtag team clean surface or team like this makes perfect sense to me, you know? so. I'm down here, I am at my computer. You probably can't see, but I'm looking at my Excel spreadsheet. I am meal planning today. If you remember, my meal plan from last week was kind of non-existent. I really lucked out <laughs> with not actually having to cook anything. I know that's not going to be the case this week. So I find that the best thing to do is just to go ahead and plan and get it out of the way so that I'm not tempted to get lazy later on in the day. Same thing with exercising. I'm the type of person, I have to get it all done early in the day or I will be tempted to not do it at all. So I'm planning my meal, then I'm gonna get exercising, and then I'm actually gonna meal prep. I'll let you know what I decide on once I get it all figured out. Hi, Bubby. Hi, Mitty Girl. Milton, sit. Sit. Okay. Stretch, good boy. Sit. Milton, your bandana's all messed up. Sit. Go over there. Are you gonna sit? Good boy. Okay, gang up on me, jeez Louise. Hey guys, today is a scorcher. Like it turned really hot really quick, but it was like really sunny. Uh, so I wanted to do my zip fish shake outside. Uh, I am recording here for you guys, but I'm also live right now on my uh, Facebook group. If you don't know, I have a Facebook group over at Watch Autumn Keto. It's a Facebook page, but there's also a private group exclusive for my patrons. Uh, and so we are having a ball in that group. I go live there uh, basically every day. There's so much interaction. There uh, is so many posts by other people and good inspiration and resources. So you can definitely check out my Patreon page. I'll put the link right here, but check that out. See if you're interested in becoming a patron uh, so you can join this group and it's a lot of fun and I'd love to have you. So I'm shaking it for you. You'll see this the next day, but they're seeing it right now. Hi, Rosemary, how you doing? I'm not going to the gym. I am doing Les Mills Body Combat in the basement. Uh, I was trying to figure out if I wanted to be outside, but it's not that I want to be outside. I just don't want to go to the gym. So I'm gonna be working out in my basement, but before I work out, you know I got to shake a zip fizz. Hi, mom, how are you doing? <laughs> okay, but I, I usually grab it from the correct pocket. I did not grab it from the correct pocket this time. And boom, oh man, peach mango today. It is peach mango and it is one of my favorites. So let's do this. Oh yeah, look how easy that is. All right guys, let's get ready to shake it. It turned hot, so I need to get back inside. Let's get ready to shake it in three, two, one. <laughs> to having a great day. Mm. Oh, peach mango. Mm. Now, if y'all didn't know this, the ingredients of peach mango are kind of sketch. Like the third ingredient is maltodextrin and that really hurts. Like you gotta be checking the ingredients here. I mean, it still has the same number of carbs and everything. I don't know why they switched to maltodextrin. I'm not really pleased, but it's not enough by any means to make me stop drinking it, but like, Check the ingredients for every product. So I'm gonna drink this, work out, get to cooking. Okay, I just finished body combat. It was amazing. That tans down like probably my favorite group exercise workout ever. Like Les Mills on demand. I'll put the link in the description box below, but uh, 
It's almost football time, so I'm gonna sit down. I deserve it, that was amazing. Uh, I still got some zip is left, which is a win. So I'm gonna enjoy this, watch the first round of games. I'll get up, meal prep. I have to go to the shop today, as usual, and I'll tell you about what I'm making in a little bit. Tuna and pork runs, football. Okay guys, I am headed to the shop. As you can see, I just whipped up some taco meat there. I am having pork rind nachos for meal prep this week. It's just gonna be pork rinds, that meat, some cheese. Oh, now I'm just reminded I have to shred some cheese when I get back home. <laughs> some cheese, sour cream, some salsa on top, and that's just gonna be amazing. Also, what you saw me mix together, uh, the little pudding concoction that I made last week from the Lee's brown butter ghee that I bought off Switch Grocery and heavy whipping cream and that preferred keto chocolate collagen powder, I was like racking my brain trying to figure out what it tasted like and you guys, I figured it out. It's a Werther's original. Like, it tastes just like a Werther's original. So, I'm trying something different. I'm gonna pop it into the freezer and then when it comes out, like, try to cut it into little candies to like see if I can actually like make a Werther's original. Like I'm very excited about that. Um, but I have to get to the shop right now, do a couple hours of work. When I come back home, I'm gonna shred that cheese cause I totally forgot about it till right this moment. And I will wrap up the meal prep. Okay guys, I am done with meal prep. It is quite random this week, but like, it could also be really delicious. I'm very excited. Before we get into meal prep, I wanna thank Preferred Keto for actually sponsoring today's video. Uh, this is that chocolate collagen that I have been using pretty much in every meal prep for the past six weeks. It is delicious. I've been looking for a collagen to use for a while just because of the benefits of like hair and nail and things like that. And this tastes delicious and you can do a lot of different stuff with it. I'm pumped to show you what I did with it this week. In the description box below, there is a link to the website where you can use my code. I'll also put it on the screen right here. But check out the Preferred Keto website. They have a lot of awesome stuff, but the number one for me by far is this chocolate keto collagen. Okay, this week's main meal is a taco bowl, and then there's just a bunch of random stuff going along with it. So for the taco bowl, I have some pork rinds, some hot and spicy pork rinds, lettuce, I have meat, cheese, sour cream, I have some onion, jalapeno, hot sauce, I think that's all that's gonna be on my taco bowl. Then randomly, I have some keto brick. I just cut this up into pieces, and this is the coconut cream keto brick that I'm gonna have as a snack. Another snack I'm gonna have are these Chipotle Live Wraps. I actually tried these for the first time at KetoCon, and I got them from Switch Grocery, uh, which is the same place I got that brown butter ghee. Um, I'll put the link to that in the description as well, but these things are delicious. I actually had them at KetoCon with just cream cheese, so I wanted to just recreate that exact same thing. So I'm having one and a half wraps, and I'll probably cut them into triangles and then just have some cream cheese on it, and it is so good. Another snack, I'm having some cello wisps. I bought these at Costco. These little individually wrapped bags are the cutest thing ever. And then this is what I'm most excited about. I don't know if you can see, but this is what I made those, I don't know, fat bombs, popsicles, I'm not sure. 
This is just that brown butter ghee, some heavy cream, and that preferred keto chocolate collagen. This is like a mixture between a fudge pop and a Werther's original, and I am obsessed. I gotta put them in the freezer because they do need to be frozen, but I mean, I've tried one of these and they are creamy and chocolatey, but also caramely and amazing. All right, finally, I got Jell-O, I got Zevia, and I am bringing back the ice drinks. These are the Meyer versions. But I am looking forward to having these. I'm going to keep an eye on how they make me feel, if they make me have cravings and things like that. But they taste good and I just wanna to try to mix it up a little bit. Okay guys, and that's it for this week. Be sure to watch my What I Eat Wednesday video to see like how I actually eat all this stuff. I'm interested in seeing how it comes together as well because right now it's like a bowl of nachos, which that makes perfect sense to me, but that's pretty much the only thing. So I have to see how I wanna put this together throughout the week. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you like it, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel, Watch Autumn Keto. I make weekly meal preps, weekly what I eat Wednesdays, monthly weigh-ins, monthly keto crate unboxings, and the occasional product review and recipe. You can also find me on Instagram and Facebook at Watch Autumn Keto. Thanks, and I'll see you next week.